My name is Kendall Goldfarb. I'm a senior on the women's lacrosse team at Presbyterian College. Morgan's message has been around for over over a few years. It's still relatively new. Um, it's growing though. So we have tons of campuses, over a few hundred. So Morgan Rogers was a Duke women's lacrosse player who died by suicide. And the main goal of Morgan's message is to use everything you know that she went through and really raise awareness for mental health and student athletes. The mission of Morgan's message is to promote student athlete mental health and really open up the conversation and allow student athletes to know that they're not alone and that what we're all going through is real and validated and that there's help if we need it. I found out about Morgan's message through a friend who played at Duke and it impacted me a lot because I have a lot of mental health background and when I heard her story I was able to relate to it and you know I wanted to use that to help others. So you can become an ambassador in their education program and I heard about that and reached out to Donna Rogers, Morgan's mom, and she showed me like the steps how to get involved and bring it to our campus. The education program is intended to come to campuses to promote that student athletes aren't alone and show them the resources available to them. And the ambassadors, our role is to bring those meetings and resources to the widespread student athlete population rather than just, you know, having them out there. So we can set up meetings so that people know what's going on and how to get help and, you know, promote awareness for all of mental health. So as an ambassador, we are required to attend one meeting every month um, with the Morgan's Message liaisons and they help us um, find the resources that we need to bring to our campus for that month. They also do almost like professional development, so we attend different um, videos and things of trainings to help bring to our campus. And so we do monthly meetings. Um, they can go anywhere from what is mental health to what are the different mental illnesses, how do you support your friends, how do you support your teammates, you know, and the different situations people might be in. So you haven't gone through it, but you're trying to help someone who has, you know, what do you do? Or you are going through it, you know, what can you do to help yourself? So I really hope to spread it to all the sports. That's our main goal. Um, and I also really want to start support groups in a way, so I want to do one for long-term injury um, athletes where they'll be able to kind of, you know, talk about, that's oftentimes like a big part of, you feel like you lose your identity when you're injured and the sport's taken away from you, and so, you know, having that group of athletes all going through the same thing and being able to express how they feel and know that they're not alone. I am an early childhood education major with an elementary add-on and my goal is to teach anywhere from kindergarten through third grade and my main goal is obviously academics are a huge part but to socially emotionally grow the um, grow the children's minds so that they know how to deal with these things later on whether they know that you know that's what I'm gearing them towards or not um, but that they know how to handle their own mental health as they move forward.